All right, good morning, friends. Happy new school year. So I will do a little bit more of an overview, probably already before this, but today is Wednesday. It's the first day of school, and I figured that I would film lunches again because we're actually going back to school. Both the girls start today. Olive starts first grade and Eleanor starts pre-K. So this is the lunchbox that Ollie picked out, really cute. And then Eleanor is still obsessed with LOL. She picked that one out. So I'll show you what it's in their lunches. I just use these cute little cupcake napkins to get them all festive and excited. A little note for Ollie. These were from the Dollar Tree a couple years ago. I don't know if they still have them. Um, and then these are their Bentco boxes. I love these. I think they work the best. So for today, the girls have the exact same lunch. They both have some little um, bagel dogs, little kolaches, but like bagel bread instead of like crescents. Um, some dots pretzels, which they both really like. Um, some snap peas, which are a little worse for wear, but they'll be okay. Some ranch, some strawberries, and there are some blueberries under there. And then they both also have some ketchup in here for their bagel dogs. Um, they have a Roaring Water Capri Sun, and they also have their water bottles. Um, this one was from Target. It's the Simp or Sip, Sim. Um, love these. And then Olive has this really cute one that it's from Cool Gear from Walmart. And then Eleanor does have snack today. She has this little, um, it's like a knockoff system. These are from the Dollar Tree. We really like these. And this is like the Auntie Anne's, um, Auntie Annie's little Cheddar Bunny pretzel mix. And then I was going to try to include um, half of this for each of them, um, the little Unicorn Debbie Cakes, but I know they're probably gonna be nervous and not have a big appetite anyway. Plus it's the first time they're gonna gauge how quick lunch is. So we're gonna start with this and then they can have one of these when they come home. So that is lunch. I will show you what they finish when they come back home. Okay, I wanted to show you our organization for our lunches stuff this year because um, if you remember, please ignore the mess. We're in the middle of life. <laughs> we used to have cabinets up here, but we got it, everything renovated and those were removed. So we don't have that extra cabinet space, which is where it kept all of our school stuff. So now we got this cart from Amazon. I will have it linked below. I love it. It's great. Um, it moves really easily. It's really nice and sturdy. It's under $100, or at least it was when we got it. I love it. Anyway, I'll share you with you what I have and everything. Um, these are new, actually. These are color-changing tumblers. They're really cute. I got these not for school, but just for the girls to have those. Okay, so right here we keep um, their lunch boxes. These are their two new ones from this year, Ollie's and Eleanor's, and these are from last year, just in case we forget our lunchbox at school, mishap, what have you, we have backups. So it's in this little plastic thing from Target. I've had this thing for years. I want to get a different colored one, but right now this will do. Um, down here, this is better organized, but this morning we were running. I was trying to get everything done. This is where we house all of our water bottles and our binco boxes, two of which are getting cleaned. We have some sandwich containers, more little like bento box containers. Um, and then here is all of the fun stuff. So I'm gonna take that out and show you. These do pull out completely. So this is where I keep all of our character napkins, um, all of our fun muffin tin holders, our cutters, our food picks, all of that type of stuff. These three are new. I just picked these up from the Dollar Tree. I just thought these were so fun and pretty. And then some fun rainbow star ones and then some mermaid ones. Um, always have to include napkins for them while they're at school. So I just like to get fun character ones. We have a couple snack containers in here, but these are all of our napkins that we still have. A lot of these are um, like holiday. We have Halloween and some Christmas ones. And then we have like trolls. Lots of these, the majority of these, I get these all from Walmart for under a dollar. And then we have some lunchbox notes, which I'm trying to find, I feel like all of them are so expensive. Like everything on Amazon is like $10, which is crazy to me. These were from Dollar Tree a couple years ago and I couldn't find any more this year. So this is what we have, but I'll show you my replacement for when we run out of these. We also have the rest of our food cutters right here. Then all of the food picks that are like plastic, you know, 
ones that come in its little special containers or little bags and stuff that I get on Amazon. We have some mini food cutters. We have some um, edible color markers and then some more little snack trays, more food picks, some um, to go silverware, all that type of stuff. So this is how I keep everything down here. I need to make it a little bit more organized because this morning, again, like I said, I was running around like crazy, trying to make sure we weren't late. But let me show you the couple of things that I got um, outside of the napkins from Dollar Tree. Ollie's big on notes. She loves getting the notes from school. So I got just this pack of colored papers from Notepad just from Dollar Tree. Um, and I can just write her a cute note every day, different colors. I thought it was perfect for your little ones who love lunchbox notes as well. You can always write it on the napkin. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to go crazy. I just think it's extra fun. So I got a pack of these and then I got some fun stickers to decorate it with. So these are just some fun food stickers. And then I got a pack of Lisa Frank because this is more for me than for her <laughs> because I love Lisa Frank still. So that is our kind of organization tactics and all the stuff that we use. It's worked out really well. I really like this cart. Again, I will have it linked below. It does come in different colors. We, of course, we have like some other stuff, cutting boards and stuff on here, but so far I love it. It's worked out well. Yeah, I'll have everything linked, but I wanted to share that with you just to show where we put everything. All right, we are home. It's been a long day, we're all tired, but I figured I would show you what they ate. Um, both girls brought their water, most of their water's gone. Um, Eleanor drank her roaring waters when she got home. Ollie didn't drink hers. Um, I did get these, I meant to show you these this morning. The new ice packs from Cat and Jack, this one's a little kitty cat we got. Um, for Ollie, no, this is Eleanor. Eleanor did pretty good. She ate all of her fruit, her piece, uh, her snap pea crisps, her uh, most of her pretzels. She only did eat one of her little hot dog bites, but that's okay. I expected her not to eat a whole lot anyway because I'm sure she was nervous. And then Ollie did pretty good. The ranch leaked. You were you were nervous. Um, Ollie did really good. She ate almost everything besides her few pretzels. So she did really good, but the ranch leaked everywhere. So next time, I think I'm going to fully just do ranch in here. I had ketchup in here, so that's why I didn't do that. But I think next time ranch is going in the little cups because that's a hot mess. But that is lunch for today. The girls did really good. Ollie has school tomorrow, so she will. Oh, it's great. Ollie has school tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. We started midweek this year. Ollie has school tomorrow, so she will have it. Eleanor doesn't have school again until Friday. So you'll see only one tomorrow and then two on Friday. And then I'll probably sloth these on to next week's as well. So there we go. First day done. All right. Good morning, friends. It is Thursday. Ollie goes to school today. Eleanor stays here with me. Um, so this is just Ollie's lunch. I just made her a little note. Um, I got these new, I think I showed you guys these already in this video, but I got these fun rainbow metallic star napkins from Dollar Tree. And this is the Sistema um, little bento box. I love these. I want more of them. These are so great. They come with extra compartments and little cups. They're great. Anyway, I made Ollie two turkey and cheese um, little sliders. These are on Hawaiian roll. She loves these. Some puffs, some like pirate's booty puffs, um, a number of slices of seaweed, which is her favorite, and then some apples that I covered in pineapple juice. Um, one of her favorite lunches, really yummy, really easy, and then this thing just locks up, perfect. And then she also has the same snack that Eleanor had yesterday. This is the Annie's like mix with like the bunnies and the crackers and the pretzels. And then she has her water. Please ignore sink. We're getting there. She has her water and then a roaring water for lunch. And that is lunch for today. So we'll see you later. All right. Day two is finished. Ollie has been keeping her little notes, which is so sweet. So um, anyway, she's back home. We have her snack. She wasn't a fan of the Annie's snack mix. Eleanor really liked it. I don't like the flavor either. Um, I don't ever really like any of the Annie stuff. I know it's supposed to be healthier and stuff. I just do not like the flavor. So she was not a fan, but Eleanor likes it, so she'll end up finishing it. Um, halfway done with water. Ice pack went well. This this came with this set, by the way. It was really cute. Um, okay, so for lunch, we didn't eat our sliders very much. We ate all of our 
puffs. We ate our seaweed, some of our apples, but we barely ate our main. Those are normally your favorite. I know, but I didn't have time. I tried to eat all of these of the rest first. Okay, eat your main stuff first and then the other stuff, okay? Okay. Okay, so that was today. Hopefully tomorrow's a better day. We will see. But that is, I mean, it's still cold, so she can technically still eat them later if she wants them. But that is lunch for today. See you tomorrow. Good morning, friends. Happy Friday. We made it into the week. Both girls are at school today, and they both have the exact same lunch. Um, we have these little turkey roll-up doodad little guys. Um, and then we have some pirate tweety puffs, some uh, grapes, carrots, some ranch in here. And then I'm hoping this closes. I actually don't even know if it's going to close. Um, we went with Trolls napkins today. Ollie's note. Ollie's having cheese yet today. We bring Eleanor a bar. And they both have their water bottle and that is lunch today i'll show you what they eat when they come home all right guys end of friday it's late we're getting ready for bed we were out all day but thought i'd finish showing you this week's lunches and what the girls finished so this was ellie's she did really really well she ate pretty much everything really proud of her she did a great job ollie also did really really great job so good job finishes the week off strong with eating our lunches but that is the end of lunches for this week i'll probably uh combine this with next week just so we have a full week and a half of lunches but we're done first week of school down glad it's done good morning friends happy monday start of our week and the kids go full time this week um, all five days, well, Eleanor goes three days, but Ollie goes all five days, our first full week of school, so let's see what they have to lunches. Um, today we did kind of make your own Lunchables. I just had Ritz crackers, some of this thick um, sliced sharp cheddar, and then pepperoni. And then we have some fun little picks in here. Um, and then we have some craisins in both of them. Um, I think these are the sugar-reduced ones. Eleanor normally loves craisins. All it isn't normally, so we'll see how if she's changed. Uh, we have the slushy go-gurts right here for both girls. Um, and then they both have some broccoli with these cute little unicorn picks. It's our theme of our lunches today. And then some ranch dressing. All of her snacks has some Cheez-Its. Eleanor has a fruit leather. Um, both have their water, and then Ollie has her roaring water. And that is their lunch for today, so we'll see you after school. All right, we are home, guys, home on Monday. So Ollie forgot her lunchbox at school, so I don't have that to show you. Um, but this is what Eleanor ate. She pretty much ate almost everything. She did a good job. Ate all her broccoli, all of her uh, go-gurt, most of her little lunchable thing, and then... Um, she didn't get to her craisins, but they're all covered with broccoli, so we're going to say a farewell to those. But she did a good job. And then this is one of the other little ice packs. It's all melted now, but ice packs that we got from Target. I will say that these don't stay cold as long as some of the other ones do, but it's still cold, so it'll be fine. Um, oh, we did remember her water bottle that she left last week, so she brought this one, but... Um, the, these are these cool gear ones that I got from Walmart and they're on sale. So the other day I got this one for Ollie and it was like four something. And today this was two fifty. So I really like them. Um, they're easy and the insides right here, you freeze them. So it's like an ice, uh, you don't have to put ice in there. It's just like an ice cube essentially. And I really like that. So, um, I got a second one because you know, we're forgetting our thing. So we have backups and I thought it was super cute. This one was the unicorn one, but they had all different sorts of ones. So I got a back one up, back up. I got a backup one at Walmart today, but that is lunch for Monday. So we'll see you tomorrow, Tuesday. All right, friends. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. <laughs> um, Ollie is going to school today. Eleanor doesn't go to school Tuesday, Thursday. So it's just Ollie. Um, this is what I packed for her lunch. This is just the Sistema little case. I love these cases i want to buy more i think i actually even love them more than the mento box they're just so convenient um but we just have kind of like a fun rainbow theme my very hard riddle <laughs> um i just gave her another turkey 
um, and cheese sandwich. This is on a Hawaiian roll bun, um, and I just took little toothpicks in here to hold them together. Again, she loves seaweed, so I gave her seaweed. Um, then there's some Cheddar Jack Cheez-Its down there, and then some grapes. She has a Capri Sun, her ice water, um, and then for snack, she has a tropical fruit applesauce. And then if she wants, if she's still hungry, she's been very hungry lately because of probably growth spurt and all the energy she's burning off. So I did pack her some of these pretzels. They're the knockoff versions of the Dots pretzels. My girls love the Dots pretzels, but they're also like $5.99 for a bag, which is insane to me. So Snyder's came out with one that twisted and they're the seasoned ones. And to me... I don't taste the difference. I know some people argue about this, but this tastes like dead on to me for the Dots ones. So I packed those two for her snack and this is her lunch. I know not super, super exciting, but you know, real mom life here. Um, so we'll see what she eats when she comes home. She forgot her lunchbox yesterday. So we're getting in the habit of trying to remember it. Um, a little bit harder when you're doing it every day and it's you're kind of like your own independent woman with it so she's this is her lunchbox from last year's from justice um so that is what she's taking for her lunchbox today and um we'll see you later all right friends we're back ollie did find her new lunchbox so we're good with that i won't show you two days old of food um, but from today, she did really good. She ate pretty much everything. Those sandwiches are always a big hit. We just use them on Hawaiian buns, and I swear, like, the kids always eat them. They love sandwiches. So I know sandwiches aren't super exciting and fun, but it's always a hit. And then Cheez-Its, um, seaweed, a couple of grapes left over, but overall great. I love these. I think I said this this morning, but I will buy more of these. We have a blue one and a green one, and I want to get the pink and purple because these they are like my favorite they're better than the, the bent goes to me in my opinion i really like them um these are the dollar tree now goth versions but uh she ate most of her pretzels and i don't think she made it to her applesauce so we'll put that back but that was lunch for today so see you tomorrow ollie's buying lunch tomorrow so she won't have it um but eleanor will be going to school so i'll show you eleanor's lunch but um yeah, so we'll see you guys. See you guys tomorrow. All right, good morning, friends. Happy Wednesday. We're halfway there. Um, I have lunch for Eleanor today. Ollie went and bought lunch for the first time today. She's very excited about it. So I just have Eleanor's to show you. Um, we have sunny day napkins. If you guys have been watching my channel for a while, you, you would remember that Ollie was obsessed with sunny day. And I have a few left, and the show's been canceled. A long time ago um but it makes me so sad because it's just it gives me a lot of memories <laughs> anyway so we have a sunny day napkin um and then i like i said these sistema sistema boxes are great so she has a fizzy blue raspberry gogurt um chunks of ham mozzarella cheese and little ritz crackers um she has some of those snyder's uh dupes for the dots pretzels right there uh, those are the seasoned ones and then she has a bunch of orange slices she loves orange slices um so that's her lunch and then for snack she has just some like four peanut butter crackers and then of course her water bottle and that is lunch for today so i'll show you what she finishes when we come home all right we're home um this is what eleanor ate she did really really good today she ate all of her little crackers meat and cheese her gogurt her um her oranges she just didn't get to her pretzels but all in all she did a really really good job see you tomorrow good morning friends happy friday this is probably the last um, meal that will go up in this video. Um, we didn't do yesterday's because Eleanor was home with me and Ollie's on a lunch buying rampage. <laughs> um, at least in our state, but I want to say it's national, at least for this year during the pandemic. Um, and I want to say it happened last year too. All K through eighth graders in public school um, get free lunches. And so Ollie has been loving it and feeling so big girl and independent. So she's bought her lunches a lot this week, I think three different times. Um, so we just have Eleanor's and I also wanted to put a quick disclaimer is in the past, um, I've had comments that's like, oh, sandwiches, why would you like, oh, sandwich, that's not entertaining or whatever. 
but um, I've had a lot of you guys request school lunch videos and I am just a normal mom. This is what my kids like. This is what she requested today. And on top of that, um, I love filming this content because I think it's fun just to give different ideas and to kind of see different um, like products and stuff like that. But my content isn't solely like lunchbox videos where it's like you can dedicate all your time and like thought process and budget to that. And so we're working with it. So I hope you got some ideas out of this nonetheless. And if your kidders are going back to school or just started, I hope they're doing great and are staying safe. Um, and yeah, so thank you so much for watching this week's lunch video. I hope you guys got a lot of ideas out of it and enjoyed it. Let me know below if you still want to keep seeing them. Anyway, so this is Eleanor's lunch. I believe I showed this to you guys already, um, but I think it was Ollie's. I don't know if Ellie's taken one of these. Maybe she might have, but she really, really likes them too. Um, they're just Hawaiian rolls, and then the regular full-size Hawaiian rolls. I do sometimes the full-size or the sliders. Either one, they both love them. Just turkey, cheese, there's no dressing or anything on it, just dry. Um, cut in half. I wish that I would have gone with the cuter picks to match the theme, but I didn't realize I was going with the theme. Um, apples with some lemon juice over them this time. Um, some of the Ritz crispy, crisper little things. They all really like those. Um, for her snack, she's taking some of the Scooby-Doo like graham crackers. And then these are our new mermaid napkins, but it kind of fits her motif today. Um, I'm working with what we got because we need to clean all of our dishes we're running behind. It's been a week, you know? So we got what we got, but these are just little sandwich trays, but they work if you have these, and these are super inexpensive. If you don't want to buy bent bo bento boxes or anything like that, you could easily do this stuff. Um, and then I just made her a little note. Um, she can't read yet, so I can't write her like a full note thing, but just something fun. And then this is the water bottle. These are, like, I think I already said this this week, but these are from Cool Gear. They're Walmart. And the inside is like an ice pack, so you freeze it so it stays cold. We already have one. Eleanor or Ollie has one, and it's, it's worked out really well. And all um, this is Eleanor's now. They're only like $2 right now at Walmart, so I recommend getting them. Anyway, um, she's taking her old lunchbox from last year because she wanted to switch it up today. But that is lunch for today and the end of this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know below if you guys still want to see these, and I will see you next week.